Swindon, 1976. Uh, right, this is me. Oh, this town is horrible. I wish I could find some way of escaping. Hey, you're Andy Partridge. You write good songs and play the guitar well. That's right. Who are you, mystery bass man? I'm Colin Moulding, and this is Terry Chambers. Uh, you must be Terry, the drum player. Yes, I am. I play the drum. Hey, let's go to the pub and talk about being in a group, then. Let's get pissed first. Hey, guys, we need a keyboard player to flesh out the sound. I wonder if there are any here. Look, there's one over there, a bored one. Gosh! Hey, Barry, what's your name? My name is Barry. Uh, I play the keyboard. Great, we need a keyboard player. Why don't we go to London and be famous, kids? Punk rock is just starting up and they'll swallow anything. Hey. Great idea. Well, let's cut to the London thing now. And so the group went to London. Oh, Christ, bloody hell. Change that sign. That says Swindon. Work with Alan, it's not quite Alan's. Mm. I thought they were going to give us more money to do this. Well, you pay peanuts, you get monkeys. I know. Yeah, you're right. Well, look. Yeah, welcome. So they went to London. Oh, they went to London. They went to London. Oh, oh here we are in London uh, with our music, our punk rock, and our manager. Wait a minute, we haven't got a manager. Yes, yes, hello, chaps, yes. We're all going to make lots of money, rich and famous and things like that. Wonderful, I think we should go and see a record company. Virgin Records, fabulous. Let's go to their headquarters over there straight away. Oh, this is, oh, hang on. So the group went to see the powerful and magnificent Virgin Records. Yes, yes, wonderful, yes. Punk rock all the rage at us, and you fellows play guitar. Yes, have them signed up. Do you like ballooning? I do. <laughs> I'm trying to kill myself in as many different ways as possible. Yes, wonderful. I'd like to see you playing a gig like the Marquee or something. And so the group did many gigs at places like the Marquee and... Uh, Oh, God. And other places. Um, oh. Oops. Well, here they are from Swindon, XTC! Soiling my loon pants. Wonderful. Sign them up. Oh, Simon Draper, come on and give them lots and lots of money. Wonderful, wonderful Barry Andrews. Wonderful. Wonderful fellas. Wonderful. Take this money and uh, buy some ice cream. Fantastic. Then we're on the road to fame and fortune. Here we go. Let's tour the world. Yay. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, but make a record first. Oh yeah. Yeah, we better do that. So we did lots and lots of touring, and we made uh, our first LP. Yeah, this isn't that's it. That's not it. No, that's not it. I know, but they didn't send one. This is our. This that's is our the, first this is, EP. Right. Uh, so we made an EP and, and two LPs, and did lots and lots of touring. Uh, and Barry Andrews uh, wanted to leave. I make Colin. Barry has left. Yes. And there's we don't have a keyboard player. And I don't know any keyboard players. What do are you? we going to do? No, I don't. What the heck are we going to do at the height of our fame? I know. Let's have a guitarist. Wait. David Gregory. Call David Gregory. Hang on, I'll just go to this side. Excuse us, excuse us, hang on. Excuse me. Call David Gregory. Call David Gregory. Where's David Gregory? This is when David Gregory comes onto the scene. Gosh, you're a guitar player. You can come and be famous with us, and we'll make lots of LPs, like Drums and Wires, which we make next. But I, I can't, fellas. I've got a country and western gig tonight, and I can't make the gig. I'm sorry. Look, I said don't mention that country and western bit. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. I, I'm so I'm in the band now, am I? Yeah, you, you're in, but I think oh, we should right. do that again. All right, let's tour the world then and make drums and wires and uh, Black Sea and things. Let's go everywhere, like uh, Japan and Australia and New Zealand and Venezuela okay. and Wales and things. 
Years of lightning playing France, Australia, Holland, the United States and Canada. Venezuela, <laughs> New Zealand, <laughs> Germany. <laughs> women touring, wine, women, and song was their staple diet. Oh, bloody hell, I'm fed up with this. Um, look, can I stop touring? I mean, basically, look, I'm really sick of being a bloody vegetable. I'm, I'm a potato. I wanted to be one of the toys. I could have been the good-looking toy. I'm, look, get him off. Get, get him off that bus now. Oh, you're spoiling it. I know, but I don't really want to be a potato anymore. I don't. Andy okay. stops touring. Well, if you're going, I'm going as well. I'm going to Australia to get married. See ya. Oh, uh, bye, Tam. Hope you will uh... The recording years. XTC in the studio. XTC experimenting with unusual instruments and perfecting multi-tracking to make wonderful records and using a succession... A uh, bewildering... A, bewilder a bewildering variety of, of producers, producers such as... Steve Lillywhite. Steve Lillywhite. <laughs> And his friend, Hugh Padgham. Hugh Padgham! Big round of applause for Hugh Padgham, ladies and gentlemen. Steve Hindu Nye. Steve Nye. There he goes. Up the endeavor. Oh, he's fallen over again. Oh, dear. <laughs> David Lord! David Lord, come on down. Um, he doesn't actually really look much like that, but that's all we've got. And then, the record company introduced us to the magnificent Todd Rundgren. From the Todd Rundgren produced album, Skylarking, the single Dear God caused much controversy in America to the damnation of Andy. <laughs> In the years that followed, much TV came their way. After the success of their album Skylarking, the group again went to America to record. Oh, God, for the want of a few pennies, it's, 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 it's L.A., it's not New York, it's L.A. The amateur... Oh, all right, if you have to, if we have to. Right, can we get on with it now? XTC's career with Geffen Records continued at quite a pace when they flew to LA on... Richard Branson's airline, Virgin Airlines. And they met with young up-and-coming producer Paul Fox. Wise guys, I love all your stuff. It's great. It's fantastic. You sound great. Wonderful. We're going to make a great album. A great album. It's going to sell barrel loads. Why don't you meet John Kalotner from Geffen Records? I love that guy. He's great. I mean, he's a personal friend of mine. He's just wonderful. He's like God. Why don't we meet him now? Hang on a sec. I'll just get him. Hi, fellows. John Kalotner of Geffen Records. It's so nice to shift your units for you. I hope we're going to sell a lot of copies this time. Um, are you here to make your wonderful new album, uh, Oranges and Lemons? Oh gosh, it's me! It's going to be a huge seller! Bye-bye from all of us here. Uh, there it is. There's the sleeve. 